All right, all right, all right. So I was scrolling the AFL app earlier today and I noticed that Josh Dunkley has been offered a really nice offer from Brisbane. Too much to ignore. According to a close source to the situation, it is believed to be a bigger offer than that of the Bulldogs. Port Adelaide are keen on him as well, but Brisbane have been the most aggressive in recent talks with Dunkley being on a tour of their facility. Now, if I'm the dogs, I'm just going to match the speculator offer from Brisbane. Even though he's free to go where he wants, the acquisition will still need to be done in a trade. Josh is still probably a top three player in the dogs' side, so the trade would have to be a good one, where the dogs are getting properly compensated back. Brisbane's earliest pick is 15, and they also have to keep draft points for father-son pick Will Ashcroft, who is the son of former Brisbane champ Marcus. Now this will mean that the Dogs may have to be open to accepting future picks down the track. Dunks had made one piece of a superb midfield, arguably the best midfield in the league. It includes the likes of Bonson Pally, McRae, Libertore and Bailey Smith. So there's a lot of depth there already, but to lose a guy of this ilk is hard to replace. His season did start off a little rough by his standards. He had some minor setbacks at the beginning of the season and never really found the form of last season where he averaged 28 disposals a game. In the latter half, he came good, and in the only final the Dogs played, he tried his heart out to get his team over the line with 23 disposals and a whopping 14 tackles in a desperate performance against Frio. Even though he's leaving, I'm really happy with his service towards my football club and helping the boys win in 2016. Anyway, guys and girls, please let me know what you think of Josh leaving the kennel. Also, like the video and subscribe to the channel. Thanks.